Hello and welcome to time series forecasting. In the previous video, I showed you a simple exponential smoothing method which is used when a time series uh, does not show any clear trend or seasonality. In this video, I'm going to introduce a method which allows forecasting of a time series with a trend. And previously, we talked about forecasting based on uh, initial state and uh, then use that state uh, to forecast our equation based on uh, this alpha parameter or the smoothing parameter. Now, the whole linear trend method extend these two equations to include trend in a series. So, we're going to build uh, three equations here. The first equation will be again based on the level of the series. In addition to level, we're also going to include uh, this term HBT. And H here is again our forecast horizon and BT is our slope or estimate of the trend. So now our forecast equation will be based on uh, the slope of uh, the trend and remember here we are estimating a time series with a trend. So here we are using uh, the slope parameter of uh, this line in the forecasting equation. And then our level equation will again depend on alpha yt as it was in the previous case and uh, the previous level of uh, the initial state and in addition will include uh, the value of uh, slope in the previous period in this uh, level equation. In addition to these two equations since we are introducing uh, a trend in this time series therefore we have to introduce a third equation here. Now this third equation will estimate uh, the slope and this slope will depend on uh, the change in uh, the level from time t to t minus 1 and the slope in the previous uh, time period and we'll control how much uh, weight we want to assign to this change and this uh, slope parameter by controlling for this smoothing parameter beta star which is smoothing parameter for the trend and the value of beta star will be again between 0 and 1 and again uh, we'll have alpha here and uh, alpha will be between 0 and 1 and alpha is a uh, smoothing parameter here again. Essentially we are extending uh, the same uh, two equations here and including the trend equation here and we'll include a smoothing parameter for the trend and uh, this smoothing parameter will control how much weight we want to assign to the slope and uh, the change in uh, the level. Essentially you don't have to use these equations but the main thing is that uh, you remember all these parameters so that uh, when you look at the results you have a pretty good idea that uh, alpha is representing a smoothing parameter for the level equation, beta star is uh, the smoothing parameter for the trend equation and uh, bt is the slope estimate for the trend and h is uh, our forecast horizon etc. So you should know about uh, these parameters. Alright, I'll see you in the next video to show you an example using uh, this method.